What's up? Welcome. I'm going to do a quick, uh, quick vlog. It's called a vlog. It's called a daily, no, let's call it a wad log <laughs> for now. So this is a wad log. Uh, this is basically a recap of my workout from yesterday. Hopefully in the future we can make it a little more timely. So I plan to do these a little closer to when I actually work out. So the workout was yesterday, which was, uh, the 23rd. So this is a recap of that. Um, this is the workout that I'm going to be talking about. I'll just basically go through the warm up, skill work, and then the wad. So the workout of the day. So yesterday we started with a 600 meter run. I uh, actually felt pretty good about that uh, because typically I'll have to like stop, jog, you know, it'll be like a um, sort of a semi run, lots of like break it up with walking every, you know, couple hundred meters. But yesterday I actually committed to a full 600 meter run, uh, which was good. You know, the only thing that was weird or felt weird was my calves. My calves tip, tend to cramp a little bit. So uh, they were tight and I still felt like they were gonna cramp at any time, but luckily they didn't. So I was able to finish that run. You know, the rest of this, the warm up was pretty straightforward. 10 push ups, hollow to opens. Um, we did some dumbbell seat, uh, dumbbell seated presses, uh, left and right, you know, uh, it was one, so basically 10 on each side. I did that at uh, 30 pounds, uh, dumbbells. Uh, by, towards the end of that, the, you know, the last 15, 20, uh, that got a little heavy, but other than that, th those felt good. Dislocates, good mornings. Um, we did some support on rings, so just basically jumping up on the rings, uh, pressing out, holding that. And, and that pr felt pretty good. Actually held that for about 30 seconds and then uh, squeezed off a few uh, dips uh, on the rings. So strength there I think is getting better. Uh, for skill work, skill work was Turkish get-ups. So those are always fun um, with kettlebells. Turkish get-ups with, uh, I don't know if you can see this and I'll experiment with this as we go on. And I actually try to get some like B-roll footage and actually record some of this these movements so you can kind of get a better feel for for what I'm doing uh, Turkish get-ups uh, with two windmills at the top so basically you're doing a Turkish get-up and then at the top you're then reaching down and trying to touch basically the floor or your foot uh, I did those at 30 pounds and honestly I probably could have gone lighter because it was real slow going 30 pounds was was rough especially on my left side so pressing up with the left and then uh, pressing up with the left and then actually trying to reach down on my right. So my mobility is a little weak in that sense because it was a lot harder to, to go touch you know, the floor with my right hand, pressing up with my left. Um, so we did three sets of 10, or at least that was the uh, sort of prescribed work. I really only got through two sets of that um, just because it was slow going. Probably should have gone with like a lighter weight, maybe 20, 25 pound kettlebells probably uh, more reasonable but I did 30 and uh, it was just slow going uh, for the wad we did a Tabata it was kind of like we doubled up on the Tabata so we did dead bugs on the wall uh, alternating legs dead bugs and we did uh, dumbbell squat cleans I did those at 25 um, actually felt pretty good about those uh, dead bugs uh, lots of core you know leg work core alternating off the wall uh, actually pre felt pretty solid on those, you know, as it managed to keep the reps going pretty consistently. And then on the squat cleans, those were, squat cleans were a little light. So I went with 25s instead of typically I would grab like 30 or 35s. I uh, went a little light, 25s, just because it was about a high number of reps. And, uh, but felt pretty good because in the end I ended up with, um, on the wall bugs for Tabata times two. So basically two rounds of Tabata. So two rounds of Tabata, just picking up where we left off. I have no idea what happened. Uh, the GoPro session just stopped recording in like four minutes. So it's the first time I'm actually using the session to record. And for whatever reason, it just conked out at like four minutes. Anyways, uh, getting back to the Tabata, two, two rounds, 232 reps. At 25 pounds so that felt good felt pretty solid um, and that's basically it so that's a recap of the wad for 223 thanks for checking in if you want to sort of follow along uh, with this personal journey CrossFit journey 
Um, I'll do plan to do more of these, and like I said, incorporate some more footage, B-roll, you know, work on these edits so that it's not me talking head style, um, and I'll actually be able to get some more footage in, into these things. Um, so plan to do a lot more of these, and if you are interested in all, just subscribe to the channel. Uh, new content, um, and you know, I'm working out now roughly four times a week, pretty consistently, so I would expect that um, I can get these up just about as many times a week. So uh, that's it, signing off. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.